This week, Joseph Okoboy of the National Unity Platform said he was giving up his candidature to support the NRM candidate. Yesterday, he joined President Yoram Museveni's rally at Aguga Primary School and declared his support for the NRM candidate, Derek Oroni. But having been guided, I have to come back to the Olomite party. Now, Oroni is destined for a clean sweep after the only other candidate, Issa Taligora, opted out. So it was a painful decision though, because it was not about Taligora, it was about the population that were behind me, who were supportive of the cause. We are really so hearted, and it is not really an election that was supposed to be in Gogonyo, but it is a selection. Democracy has been stepped on. But we saw the deployment that was in Gogonyo. It seems that is the pressure that made our candidate pull off. The Parliamentary Elections Act states that any vote cast on polling day for a candidate who has withdrawn his or her nomination shall be invalid. And so the Electoral Commission body has said that Thursday election will go ahead as planned. The candidates were three, but one has pulled out. He has officially pulled out. That is Isa Taligola. He brought here his withdrawal letter. We still have the NUP and NRM on board. Should we get a letter from NUP, which must come from the sector region, to inform us that the candidate has pulled out? If the letter comes by five, then tomorrow we shall not have elections. The Court of Appeal dismissed Oroni's election in June when it found out that he had been elected irregularly. Taligola had accused Oron of engaging in acts of bribery, undue influence, sectarianism, and deformation.